going on guys? It's me, the Ninja Viewer here. Welcome to another exciting unboxing video game, but also based off an anime, so I guess you can call it Bolt? I guess in a way? Yeah, kind of. So anyways, yeah, so... It's, well, the game just recently just popped off on Friday, and I just want to make a quick update to the My Hero Academia fans. I apologize if I couldn't get Once Justice 2 to unbox, because, um... I really didn't know if there was going to be certain delays of like items that were already on like sites like Target or Amazon. Maybe I should have checked Target, maybe, but it did say some stuff where you're doing like standard could take like a little while due to stuff of getting more essentials for certain things and sites, more than just like that. Even though Amazon is selling still regular, I mean Amazon, Target is still selling like regular things for the moment and there are some in-store pickups that you could do, which is actually pretty cool. But it's just like, you know what, compared to that and GameStop, it's like, yeah, man, I'd rather get it from Target. GameStop is a whole different story, which, oh my god. So it's like, you know what, yeah, I'd rather just do Target. And plus you get, like, some pretty cool, you know, percent off of, like, every other stuff and, like, whatnot. So, yeah, so it's actually pretty good. Luckily, though, when it came in my mail, I actually made sure I actually cleaned the shit out of it. Meaning, either have, like, a napkin with Lysol or hand ties that shit. And make it clean. Because especially what's going on right now in the world, how crazy it is. I don't want to take extra precautions. Like, you know what? Let me let me clean. Let me just, you know, clean the living shit out of this. So it'll be nice. It'll be good. Can't take any chances right now. So it's like, you know what? I'm going to do that. So I'm going to clean it up. Now, I mean, not inside. I'm not going to do the inside because that will ruin the actual game itself. Like, the outside with the plastic. Clean it all off. Bam, it's all good. Just give it some wipes. And you're good to go. So that's exactly what I did. I put gloves on too, by the way. Like I had gloves on earlier when I got the uh, package outside. I was like, yeah, don't want to take any chances. So that's what I did. You know, thinking the smart way. So, anyways, yeah. So I got it. it it's right here. It's gonna be unboxed. Um, but just to let you know, the reason that's the reason why I couldn't get Once Justice Two is I didn't know what was going on. So I caved in during my vacation week and just got it digitally. I will say this, it's a very, very fun, solid 3D Arena game. It's actually much more fun than I thought it was going to be. Like, uh, I'll save it for the review. Maybe the story mode, I caved into it way too quick. And that's sort of not a good thing if you just want to cave it in too quick. So, like, you know what? Maybe it's a good thing that I got this game digitally and stuff, like, physically. Because, like, well, it is a really fun game, but once you breathe through the story mode, you only get, like, this, like, mission mode thing the unlock customizations for like costumes and stuff when you're done that's like really it besides well okay there is multiplayer there is online so you can go online i wish i had a game capture card um able to actually produce stuff like this so you can watch gameplay at once justice 2 for online matches like if i had online matches like i can go on and on and fight people online it's really fun online though yeah you will get some you know disconnection issues and stuff like that but it's, it's not bad overall. The online is still really fun. There's going to be five DLC characters coming out for that's going to keep the game fresh and alive for a while until maybe like Once Justice, you know, 3 gets announced and then BAM! Once Justice 3, there you go. All those DLC characters, yay! They'll all be in that game. So, not to think too. Uh, it'll be a whole different story once Storm 4 comes out on Switch. But it kind of sucks because it's only digital, I think. Except if you're in Europe, congratulations, you'll get it physically. But if you're here in the West, unfortunately, I think it's only digital, but we'll see. Anyways, enough rambling on. This is based off a very famous anime. It's a Musou game, aka Dynasty Warriors type game. Here in the States, what we like to call it, Dynasty Warriors. Famous, a very famous anime, over 900 episodes. Just got the movie of Stampede, released about a week and a half ago. It's the fourth of the franchise of the series, and I love it to death. And I'm very happy it's come to the Switch lineup. The third game is also on the Switch as well, if you want to check that out, which I still love the shit out of the third game. Played it for so many hours, put so many hours onto it. On it, it's amazing. And here's the fourth of this franchise, and I'm about to show you in three, two, one, one dream, one wish. Over the top! One Piece Pirate Warriors 4. Or in Japan, it's usually Kaizo Muso 4. But anyways, I know I butchered the name, I apologize. But here it is, you got Luffy right here on the cover. I gotta say the cover does look pretty badass. I'm not gonna lie Like I think out of all the One Piece Power Warriors covers this one's the best one I don't know if we have a physical copy of the PS3 for three. I don't know if we did. I don't remember We might have did in the States. I just don't remember But I got mine on Steam. So One Piece. Well, oh yeah, I was gonna say I made a full Let's Play of Pirate Warriors 3 on the actual on my YouTube channel years ago on Steam Oh yeah, a little plug in there too. If you guys want to check out that Let's Play I did like years ago, 
I wish I could do the same thing for Power Warriors 4, but I got it on Switch and on PC, so yeah, but what can you do? Anyway, so here's the cover, why I could play this on my TV and on the go, so that's Win Win, Kaido, Rodo. By the way, speaking of voices like that, unfortunately, just like the other games, it's only Japanese voices with the English subtext, which is fine. I mean, I'm pretty much used to it by now. I know it sucks, we don't have an official dub. I wish Funimation, especially now that they did the movie Stampede and they are gonna start dubbing One Piece again, I really, really wish they could've just, aw oh man, I would've loved them to actually start doing finally the video games again. But unfortunately, I guess it's, it's never gonna happen again, but, oh well, it is what it is, I guess. But anyways, you got the back of it, you got Big Mamu, Mama, 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 in the back with Prometheus, and, uh, Prometheus and Zeus. I got Luffy just attacking that. Kaido. Charles Barkley got a Corey right here on the back. The godliest of all One Piece characters right here. Right here. Yeah. Mr. Charlotte. Charlotte Katakori, aka Mr. Charles Barkley, Mr. Slam Jam, Katakori. Yeah, I can't wait. Yo, when I actually play this game and unlock him, I am putting so many fucking levels on him. It's not even funny. Let's go, fam. All right. So here we go. About to unbox it right now. Anyways, here we go. Oh, yes. Finally. Oh, man. I don't know how much more hours I'm going to put in this one, though, but I mean, yeah, I know a lot of people are playing Animal Crossing, but it's like, I got this. <laughs> I got this, like holy shit. All right, so let's unbox. Let's all right. The game's unboxed. Ooh, that is spicy. Yo, Gear Ford, Bowman Luffy, right on the cover. That is really cool. You got him in the inside the cover. That is so cool. And there is the piece of resistance right there. The actual game. There we go. So, I'll be playing this very, very soon. Maybe I'll do a review on this as well, but we probably will be a while, though. My hero is different, because I figured that was going to be done first. And then we get to the main event. Yeah! All right. Okay, cool. All right, yes. I'm looking forward to playing this. All right, so now that I unboxed it. All right, so there you go. That's my unboxing, the One Piece Power Warriors 4. I didn't really get the big special edition one, which has the figures. That would have been hot, because there's supposed to be some... some However, I did get a downloadable code from Target themselves on, on my email. They sent me the DLC uh, code to unlock um, early access to, like, characters already. And I'm like, yeah, boy, like, I'm happy about that. So at least I'll get some, like, extra stuff. Thank you, Target, once again for that. It's really boss. It's really cool of you guys. So, yeah, so I have that. So looking forward to playing this. Uh, the other game unboxing, I guess probably won't be till Trials of Mana, which will be next month, so... That's something like next month. I think Trials of Mana will probably be the next thing. But we'll see. I played the demo. The demo is actually really, 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 really interesting. It really is. And I, and I like the combat system. And there's multiple stories that you can do with the characters. It's really cool. So maybe that. Like in the middle of next month, things will hopefully, probably, hopefully, fingers crossed, get better next month for Trials of Mana. Which, ooh, I can't wait to play that game as well. I played a bit of the demo. It's pretty fun. I might try, um, what's his face, Kevin, like, the, the beast, the beast man, I might try him. I think that's probably the character I'm probably going to go for the story, but we'll see, though. I, I still have this, so probably that'll be next month. I'm trying to see if I'm going to get Xenoblade in May. I don't know, maybe. Maybe it will pique my interest to actually play the game, but we'll see. Anyways, that's pretty much it. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below of this unboxing of One Piece Power Warriors 4. And until then, I'll see you guys for the next one. Even for anime, there might be something coming up next week or whatever yeah probably like next week ish around there but we'll see we'll see and this time just remember before i leave this video be sure to rate the video comment subscribe click that bell join the squad boys also social media plugins gamer tags as well peace soul love chicken grease and the sky and this is a since a one piece related video as well god nl <laughs> is the limit and my manga fans keep supporting while you're reading what you watch and also, one more thing, very important as well. Oh, yeah, and as Raymaster would always say, aim for the sky. And once again, now for the big important detail. Take care of yourselves out there. Stay safe. Stay gold. Just stay, just pretty much stay healthy. Stay safe. Stay gold. Just, you know, just be careful. Be cautious. And just 
do what you can just you know just to do everything to stay home and try not to go anywhere too much to avoid all this going on right now so yeah anyway that's pretty much it so very important psa from me the ninja reviewer <laughs> nice all right so that's it though so later everyone bye